All right, I finished watching season one of Marco Polo, and it was turned out decent. Um, I mean, episode five was where it turned around for me to keep me more interested. It was a nice build up to the ending. I mean, really, of course, the whole season, of course, built up to that last episode, and I thought it turned out well. Um, they had some nice action moments, some fighting, and some deaths. But, I mean, it's not on the uh, level of Game of Thrones with the deaths and writing and tons of stuff going on. But it's trying. It's giving it a nice effort. And, I mean, at one point Marco Polo was worried he was going to be executed. But... Through some planning and some help from another guy, he ended up getting out. Someone else took his place. He, Marco Polo, taught Khan how to use trebuchets, help take down this walled city, which was the what the whole season was working towards, taking down this one city and taking over. You know, the main guy that they had to fight was. Sadal, who was a very skilled martial artist with Kung Fu, and there was a nice fight at the end with Marco Polo and Sadal, and then Hunjirai stepped in and saved Marco Polo from death, and the fight with Hunjirai and Sadal was probably the best of the season, I would say, of any fights that happened. Um, I mean, it was a good overall season. I'll watch season two, definitely. I'd recommend uh, watching it if you can. And, I mean, there's too many. I, I mean, if you're looking for something to watch, I definitely recommend it. You know, Sun's Anarchy going off, and there's not too much on right now for me, anyways. I'm sure there's tons out there, but if you like what you like, I guess. Um, definitely check it out. Um, ten episodes, you can get through it pretty quickly. They're about an hour, fifty minutes to fifty-five minutes long or so. Um, yeah, it turned out a lot better than I thought. Give it a watch. Keep this one a little short. I don't want to spoil too much since it's a new show. Yeah. Um, yep. And I'll see you next time.